72 is our current temperature. Port Washington, that dew point is very comfortable. Now, as far as tomorrow around the state, it looks like we're going to have pretty much a dry day. Real slim threat of a pop up shower or thunderstorm in the later afternoon, but I think most of our day is fine. We'll keep the chance of rain mainly out to our west. A little bit cooler by the lake, but still pretty nice. We're golfing, we're going outside, or working. 80 degrees should be our average high. And how did we do today? Uh, not to the average, unfortunately. 71 so far in Milwaukee. Now, out to our west, notice we have lower 80s, but I think we're going to keep those 80s for inland sections tomorrow because we're still going to have kind of a south southeasterly wind, so cooler by Lake Michigan. But right now, it's more of an easterly wind, so it's a lot cooler by the lake. 70, Racine, Sheboygan, head to the west. Farther and farther you go, the warmer it gets. 76 in Watertown, 77, Whitewater. Now, our current dew points, these are awfully nice. Only 56 in Milwaukee. You know, you have temperatures in the upper 60s, 70s with dew points in the 50s. That's pretty comfortable. But I want you to notice out to the west, like North Platte, 66, 65 in Kansas City. Those are those dew points you can really start to feel. Those are going to be moving in here, but it doesn't look till they get here until tomorrow night. So we still have a dry night tonight and a dry day tomorrow, humidity wise, and then it starts shooting up. Satellite radar, we're quiet. Low pressure's right here. And then we're going to have a warm front kind of setting up right here through Iowa. That's where we're going to trigger the convection, and they don't want to see more thunderstorms in Iowa. They've seen enough. So that's what we'll watch develop for tomorrow, and then we track it into our area. That's what it looks like. Mostly activity out to our west, and it starts to slide here mainly late tomorrow night. That's the latest data. Now, as far as future forecast is concerned, quiet night tonight. Another really comfortable night. As we head through the day, notice most of the day dry. Can't rule out an isolated shower or storm, mainly to the west in the late afternoon. Most of the day fine. Even most of the night right now, as of the latest data looking all right, but it's late tomorrow night, could move one of those thunderstorms on through here. And that goes into Saturday as well. But tonight, mostly clear, comfortable, 57. Tomorrow, 75. Slight chance of a storm in the late afternoon. Most of our day fine. For tomorrow night, chance of storms. Looks like mainly late. It's going to be more humid as well. And Saturday, another chance of a couple scattered storms, 77 degrees. Again, that's not going to be an all-day event, nor would it be on Saturday night or Sunday. Then after that, it slowly starts cooling down. And then look at Tuesday, you guys. What, July or September? I mean, oh. even, even September would be warm for 66. What happened? Yeah, so we're cooling down next week. It's brief, though, it looks like. Yes, it is brief. All, all right, right Steve. Thank you. Yep.